Hello everybody, welcome to a video on a game called Business Magnet. It's a really fun game where you get to choose the kind of products you make, you get to research new parts to put on your products, and then make money from them. And eventually you can expand your company to become bigger and get more products. It came out on Steam recently and it's 12 bucks, but I was able to pick it up for 11.69. It, it's 10% off right now. You should go pick it up. Um, all right, so the first part is to choose what kind of company we want. We could do cars, rockets, phones, computers, trucks, tanks, airplanes, or ships. You see, every single one of these is cool. So I don't know what to choose. I am really interested in like aerospace, like in real life, it's one of my interests. So, I either wanna do rockets or planes. We'll do planes. Um, you can change the gameplay scale. I'm gonna do easy because I just got this game yesterday and I'm not very good at it. Yeah, you can, you can draw an image so I can be like, eh. Whoa, that, that can be my company image if I wanted it to. But I don't want it to be. I'll just choose one of the presets. This one looks kind of cool. I'll choose it. We'll do it on the grass. And as you can see, we started our company. Uh, so I already get the basics of this game. We got to build an office. And we have $7 million to start. By the way, um, crap, I didn't set the company name. Damn it. Oh, well, um, anyways. You, we, we have $7 million to start and the amount of starting money changes based on the product. So if you get this game and you choose a different product and you're like, why don't I have as much money as him? That's why. But first order of business is to get an office building. And since I have a lot of money to spend, I'm going to go ahead and get the biggest things I can, except for the office, because the office is expensive as hell. And we need a couple shipping areas. Okay, so now we need to hire employees. You see, it, it tells you the recommended amount. We need 16 managers. So you can go to recruitment, choose management, and start hiring. By the way, I'm so sorry that you have to hear my mouse and keyboard clicks. Uh, I don't know how to find a way around that. So yeah, I'm sorry about that. Hopefully the audio, like just my voice, hopefully that sounds fine. So if we speed up time, you see it's hiring managers right now. And okay, so we need a lot of production people. So let's just go ahead and start hiring them. Oh, actually, before I forget, let's go ahead and just make our first product. So if you go to production, design a new product, you can choose what to make. Model name, uh, we'll do it based off real planes. So I guess the... Cessna. I don't want it to be like the exact name, so it'll be Tes Tesla. So like a mix between Tesla and Cessna. Tes. I don't know. I don't find it. All right. We'll do a very light jet because that's the only thing we can do. Propulsion. So here you can see the performance and fuel consum fuel consumption. This plane is gonna be meant for just like private planes for like people who have the money. So we don't need performance. So we're just gonna go for fuel consumption. Thrust reverser, we don't have any. So it doesn't really, we don't. thrust reversers are like, they're kind of like brakes on planes, on, but they're only on some. Uh, you can see we can change out all of these to like add comfort or safety. And this is our plane. It is bad. You can see it is not safe. People will still buy it. Here you can see the recommended price of $62,900. I always underpriced it just a little bit. And I'll, I'll, I'll sell it at 60,000. Now we need to hire more employees. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. I will, I'll be back. Okay, I'm almost done hiring, so I'm just gonna go ahead and start talking to you guys again. I just need three more sales managers and, or yeah, sales managers, and I'll be good. I'll hire 10 just to be safe. All right, so now what we need to do is click on our production building, 
and as you can see we need a lot of stuff and to get that stuff we have to actually build it and you might be thinking oh that's gonna be annoying building things and then having to build the plane it, it, it gets easier trust me so as you, we need the PA680 oh that's the FA680 PA680 we'll go ahead and make three because you'll, you'll see why we need three so you can see metal and electronics are needed and we don't have that so what we need to do is go to production order supplies and then we can choose the product or and how much we want to buy i'll go ahead and just buy like 5000 ish metal and electronics i need about 10,000. and also i believe i will need rare metals but here let me check No, I won't need rare metals, but I'll need plastic. And the reason why I'm making three is because if you remember how I said that it, things would get easier to make? Yeah, um, we need to make three planes or three of our products before we can auto produce them. And what auto producing does is it makes it to where you can like even if you don't have the required parts, you can still make the plane and it'll just order it automatically. Oh yes, and my microphone is very sensitive. So even if I just tap the table, yeah, I'm sorry about that. Uh, that's probably like a big issue I have. I don't know how to find a fix for it. So I'm, I'm sorry about that. So here you can see our delivery times and we have to wait for these to come in before we can actually like you know build planes on the other hand we could also just order a bunch of these parts but you know what? i might actually do that instead of just that might actually be faster than making them myself let's see okay we still have two days before the electronics come in i'm gonna go ahead and try and do that so what was I doing? Order supplies. PA6. Sure, we'll do 10. Why not? Order supplies. Interior 10. And then. Watering analog 10. Oh, those are shorter. Okay, so. Yeah, we can just. We can do this instead of making our actual product. So I will see you once all the deliveries come in. So, okay, now we can make our planes and you can see we don't have metal. And I believe it'll automatically order metal if we don't have any. No, it doesn't, okay. Well, I gotta order my own metal then. We'll order 20,000. Oh, I just realized how long it's gonna take for these to come in. Oh, and you can see, Oh, the planes are filling up the area already. So here's what we have to do. We have to start a new campaign of our new product. Um, we don't need it to be like a lot. So we'll just do this. And then people will start buying our planes. See? People bought a plane. Oh, the other one's gone. I just need this metal to come in, or else I can't do anything. See, I love this game a lot. Even though I just got it yesterday, I still recommend that you should pick it up on your own. Um, I think once we start producing these a lot, that's where I will leave off this episode. It's probably not going to be any editing in this video. I, I could do some, but I don't really see what I need to do. Well, actually, never mind. I do know what I need to do. All right, the metal's in, and now we can make our planes. It says we don't have enough workers, so we gotta hire some more. Five, production, there we go. Oh, and you can go to the research tab, and you can get better propulsion and stuff. So we can do like this, and this will increase the price of our plane. So we'll just 
We'll just do something basic. Oh, and now you can do automatic production. This is what I was talking about earlier. Why do people keep leaving? Alright, let's get like four production. Wait, why is it waiting for resources? Oh, I don't have enough metal, do I? No, I don't. We're gonna need a lot of metal. Let's go ahead and order that. Now we gotta wait for this metal to come in. So, I think this is a good place to leave off this episode. Um, this game... I, I plan to make more episodes on it, because... I, it's really fun. You should really try it for yourself. Alright, well, I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't have a signature sign-off, so... Goodbye!